What's up guys, this is The Rifleman, and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. And as you can see, I am going to force the uh, Westphalian... these Westphalian? Westphalian forces, I think they're Westphalian. Pretty sure they're Westphalian. Anyway, I'm going to force them to attack me, and this could be a bit of a bloodbath. So lots of artillery, lots of infantry, and a big reinforcing army. Um, I too have a big reinforcing army, but it's lots of stuff that is useful in a siege battle. And don't forgetting, I do have ha uh, 24 pound howitzers that can fire quick lime. So let's get to it. It's interesting to decide whether I... Well, so my infantry... The infantry, as they arrive, or do I counter battery fire and take their artillery? Zeus. I generally, I generally go for counter battery fire at the start, and then if things get a bit dicey, I'll start switching to quick climb and going for them. Um, if they make a breach, then having one going quick climb, firing quick climb into the breach is is pretty much impulses. The enemy uh, will try to smash their Oh, I already have a breach, equipment. which they are facing. Excellent. So let's make sure there's no more. There's one back. Okay. So let's take all of my guys. So let's take. You need a line infantry. Because I need to do this. I need to deploy some guys to at least cover this. So let's group you. The main effort will be here, I think. So I want to put a unit of artillery here. I want to put a unit of marines. Content of marines inside this house. That, I'm not garrisoning that wall section because that wall section is asking to come down. So let's take. So you're deployed there. Let's take this unit of artillery and deploy it here. Turn fireball off. So let's deploy one battery here and one battery here. I'm pretty sure. I'm, for some reason, I think they're going to come from there. That's what my gut's telling me. Um, but it could be a complete and utter lie. So, eh. I'm tempted to line up here, actually, and fire up onto the walls. But then again, if I let them capture the gates, then, you know, I'll be for it. So I might garrison there. If it looked like they're going to damage both of these sections, then I'll, I will fall back. But one thing I will do is garrison... These sections. Because there's nothing to say that I'm not completely wrong. And they may actually try to do something else. So they've got all. So let's deploy the general bodyguard back here. It's got some continental marines. So let's deploy one into this building. Let's deploy a foot infantry unit here. Let's deploy a foot infantry unit here. Guard unit here. Well, no, you're not. That's not the best use of resources. So that leaves me two units in reserve, so you go here. Ah, they are over there. Okay, so then these guys can... I can recall these guys then. Although, to be honest, do I just move these guys like... Aha! I removed one of the wrong units. Oop. And let's turn my batteries onto quicklime. And yes, we are going to... Let's go for 12 pounder howitzers because they're a bit weaker. You go for them. You just toggle shrapnel shot and fire shrapnel shot at the breach. To be honest, actually, the smart thing might be to do to, as they're all nicely clumped together like this at the right angle, is to fire at my. Right. Unfortunately, I didn't target them before. Did I've almost destroyed their general's unit though, which is rather nice. Yeah, they are 
changing the axis of their advance, so I might actually keep them here. But I'm pretty sure they're probably just going to do some weird run over here, then come back in. Oh, you need to shoot at, like, them. Because you are at just the right angle. I've interfered with their loading. Oh, wow. No, 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 I cannot... No, you hit that unit of howitzers, because they have done exactly what I didn't want them to do. They're using quick climb against me, the devils. And I deployed stupidly against them. Yeah, you keep hitting that unit of... Hopefully fly the right way. Oh, good. There you go, I paid you back in kind. Let's make sure these guys garrison the walls effectively. It's nice of them to walk into fire, walk within range of this artillery unit though, isn't it? Okay, that's another unit coming in. Miss. I've hit my guards infantry unit. Stretch them right out. It's a lovely block of American infantry that have been destroyed. Oh, you hit that infantry regiment. Because you will be perfectly angled to almost destroy that unit in its entirety. Two hundred twenty-five men. Ah, oh, they long. They fired long. There we go. My men are in range. What damage we're we doing to their artillery battery? None since I last checked. Keep on firing, I guess. It's nice of these guys to walk within your field of fire. So who are they shooting at now? That unit, that's not good. Yeah, yeah, they could do the similar amount of damage there. Wow, that was a great artillery shot. Doing lots of damage to them. Aim for, aim for that unit. If you can get over the, the house. So one of them did. So if you... Yes. So you need to go for them to get the elevation. You don't need damage yet. Not to eight, so you've taken out three of them. So that's must have only got one gun in commission, or one howitzer in commission. So now is probably the time to retake your positions in a severely weakened state. Because their cavalry's moving up. Move the unit of infantry over here. What happened there? Why have you started firing that? Okay. Good. Their artillery's bugged out. Oh, 
Oh, that's a devastating shrapnel shot. Straight into the Westphalian third regiment of foot. And that was their general coming in behind them. Okay, so now their artillery's bugged out a bit. Switch to round shot and start hitting their cavalry. Oh no, actually, I might have to get this guy to start toggling quick climb onto the breach. Not necessarily the breach, maybe here. Then have this guy with his round shot target the gunners. Because he's got the angle for it now. There you go, there goes the general. Yeah, quick climb shells inbound. Yeah, damage some of the 8th Regiment of Foot. Better run. Go on, get one more volley off. Point blank. Routing, you better route. Are you firing again? They've got another shot off, so have they done any damage? Yeah, they're doing some damage. Reinforcements are coming, so what have you got back here? 12 pounder howitzer, but you've deployed right at the back, so I don't have to worry about you so much. Your this section of the wall is about to be destroyed. Okay, so this one. Might be able to get one more. See AI pathfinding's kicking in. Or lack thereof. Well, actually, this to say this section of the wall's all right. Let's get you back in position. Let the rest of them try get in. Okay, I think that approach isn't really working, so I may as well just target actual infantry units. And this should be a corker. No, half of it. The battlefield is just going to be littered with the, the, uh, the broken fractions of dead troops. Keep this unit firing at them. Hopefully, if they can make them route, break them down. Oh, here comes the, a unit of Prince Zinsberg infantry. Slowly, like an old timey slideshow. I think it's this. It's this kind of thing that can, it doesn't like. It's trying to attack me, but it's running up into the wall, but it can't do that. And I mean, based on completely no evidence and 100% conjecture, that's what I think it is. Just need this guy to do some more work and to knock out some more troops. Because that's where the reinforcements are coming from. These Dragoons have got off. The Dragoons have dismounted.
yeah, I think that's a big contributor to this sort of thing going on. My 60 second unit of line infantry is not having any of it. I've got a feeling when they do try to attack me, they're just going to run around here and try to get in and. Get my unit of howitzers to aim at the other unit of Prinzinsberg infantry. All good. The 40th Regiment of Artillery is doing the business. Ooh, more quick lime. Yes, please. They are kind of a miss. Go for that unit, the Barai unit. And this unit up here might be my MVP, the 62nd Regiment of Furt. They've just done lots of killing. So it's aim for the full units, just to get troops off the battlefield. Yeah, see, they're doing this again. There you go, and as soon as they decide not to do it, they're okay. Hit that 12th unit of line infantry. Might have missed it though. There we go. Boom! Devastating. To be honest, I might just move this unit over here too. So I can shrink this unit down a little bit. Get them in a position to fire. Get them to move around here a bit, but still maintaining their line of sight. Quick line coming down. So that's still more artillery coming in in reinforcement. Okay, so let's, let's disembark you guys. Let's, um, sorry, let's. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Limber you up. Deploy you here to, so you can get a better angle onto these. Art if you guys are going to be doing counter artillery counter battery then you guys may as well be in a good position to do counter battery so deploy over here oh, hello more infantry coming in it says target hit that lead unit of infantry when they reload that is Oh no, just keep them aiming at the gap. It seems to be working. Oh, like this. Firing. Miss. Oh, 
a miss, but it hits some of the guys back there. There's some more quicklime coming in. You guys should be shooting. Like that. Good. So hit that unit of infantry because they're at a really good angle for you. But yeah, this is the damage you can do when you've got a good uh, good defensive position, good troops. There's not really that much they can do about it. Get a rhino of it. Okay, ah, they are. Okay, so what I want to do is take this unit of infantry, move them up here, because they're being a, I'm being assaulted up that, up that sort of ladders. So let's run them around, and let's get my howitzers up and running again to target the artillery that's hitting my guys on the wall up here. These guys have routed. Which should... Trouble is, it's a Prince in Innsberg infantry, so they might not be too terrible. To be honest, I might send this infantry unit down here, then send the a unit of continental marines to do that sort of work. Yeah, that's them routing. <laughs> As are hopefully that unit of dragoons. No, not yet. They want to take more time to think about it. We got more, more mid-sits cavalry. Let's turn off the fire at will here. And let's hit their infantry as they climb up the ladders. Let's get my Continental Marines up into position with fire halt fire. So I don't shoot into the backs of my own guys. No, I should keep you up here. Working on. So who's actually shooting? They're all shooting. I think it's their artillery that's doing the majority of the work. What's a lot of. I hear cavalry dying. Turn on the fire wheel. I know what I'm doing. This. Let them form up if they want. My marines will be waiting for them if they want to press, press up the walls. You with your quick climb, focus on them, I suppose. You with your quick oh no, keep doing round shot actually, you're doing an okay. No. No, just your quick climb. Just kill them. Your accuracy seems to be better with quick climb too. Comes some cavalry, which can be shot to bits.
Here you go, let's bring my infantry back. And then let's... Okay, so what have I actually got? Artillery. Some cavalry. More infantry. Artillery. Turn off fire well, that's gonna drive me mental. Uh, let's have you quick quick line those guys to make them run away. Let's be honest, let's do this. Let's tidy up the uh, the fragments, because these guys aren't gonna do anything apart from just shoot up at this wall. So if I hit them with quick climb, they will at least maybe go away. It's got to be done. Otherwise, like I said, it will just keep on happening. To be honest, I think that's going to be the most inch. Oh no! Here comes a bunch of other infantry, which. Yep, yeah, quick climb them before they get to the fort, I suppose. These guys seem to be having trouble hitting this unit of line, so mares will target in. The fresh reinforcements coming in. Which First volley, 97 troops remaining. Hit the next unit of Prinzinsberg infantry. It's very nice of them to march up into my. into my. Uh, Castle in Square. And let's turn on fire at will for those guys. And let's watch the uh, next battery, next volley hit this unit of infantry with all six guns. Or maybe the guns will fail. Are they taking too long to reload? Oh no, there they go. Not as devastating, but still. Oh, that was pretty devastating. Hit the next unit as it comes in. God, this just isn't fair at this point. Yes, yeah, so what I'm going to do, guys, is this is going to be a bit of a rinse and repeat for me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, bring you guys back at the end of the battle screen because I'm not going to lose this realistically. And I think there's only so many. Whoop! Watch the. Oh, no! <laughs> not that you down by half. It's about to say, there's only so many times you guys can want to see um, dumb AI get punished for doing dumb things like this. And to be honest, that's all there is left. Well, might be another unit. Um, actually, I'll let you guys stick. Actually, I'll stick around just to quick line the infantry. Um, when it's just the artillery, I'll just probably start counter battering them, and that'll take forever. So I think, yeah, I'll just keep doing this. Because once they move in, they route. It's no biggie. Just look at all the dead bodies on the charge in. Oh, slight miss. Only two. Only twenty odd guys there. There we go. 44. Yeah, so ready guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut uh, cut away and then bring you guys back at the conclusion of the battle. See you in a sec guys. Radio guys, after I just bombarded them for not many minutes, I actually uh, they managed to get them to rout. So a decisive victory for me, causing a mass... And hopefully... Uh, well, depending on the, the, the level of the beating... Oh, 580 men, and they lost 3,518. 3, Delicious. That's right, you better run. Oh, and, they're, and they're sallying out to meet me in an attack. Um, yeah, let's fight this one, even though it's going to make me... Um, my, uh, over my time budget, I think it might be, might be neat, which would be rather tasty. 
Let us reflect the peace or war will always be left to our option. That, however moderate or ambiguous as it may be, we might cannot count upon the moderation or hope to extinguish the ambition of others. Alexander Hamilton. Good. <laughs> um, but yes, uh, and maybe ooh, nice a nice flat field as well. Good. Let's massacre them. One, two, three. Usually like about five units in the center. Gives me a reasonably stretched out line and also gives me a bit of flexibility. There we go. Down this flank, deploy a bit thinner than that. Two units of marines and deploy a unit of light infantry in skirmish order. Four pounder howitzers, and to be honest, because I'm going to be, I'm going to slaughter them during the uh, charge in. Um, I'm actually not going to have them fire. No, she will fire quick climb. I was about to say, do I want them to uh, rank up to gain some experience? A little experience might be good, actually. Fight. Let's make my howitzers. I'll tell you, fire shrapnel shot. Which nope, just out of range for shrapnel shot. Firing a will of nothing in particular, but everyone else is opening up on these poor buggers. Okay, let's triple speed it, because these guys are probably going to do a lot of wandering around. Garrison militia, garrison militia, garrison militia, whole rank of mortars, and good, their crews have abandoned their weapons. Hmm, they're actually trying to target me. More fireworks. I think my plan is to hit is to finish this recording and then go hit the gym. Set my set video to render. Probably be France 32, I think, to set to render. Oh no. The only thing that's gonna be in range is gonna be these gunners. If they can get the door open. There we go. And they're bugged, some of them are bugged on the door. Perfect. But yeah, I think it just makes sense to triple speed this because nothing's really happening. Just following the. Actually, so they don't do anything silly, let's do this. So if I left them to their own devices, oh god! <laughs> Poor guys. Yeah, I'd route if I were you too. Um, nothing's gonna happen. Put, try to put a hole in that wall, I suppose. Oh, hello. They've come back. Cannot blame your brethren for retreating, however. Hmm. So the AI is doing what I think it usually does, and it? it tries to deploy itself into one big line, which is dumb. Hey. You need of militia. Focus fire these poor swines of two full batteries of shrapnel shot. Let's watch them get vaporized within a few seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Nope. Guys are bugged, so they're not shooting at them. Get them to fire back at the wall. That makes them happy. 
There you go, and these militia are about to hit my battle lines. Including my light infantry, getting a first pop. Then my continental marines getting a good crack <laughs> with their top hats. Okay, so that's an enemy cavalry. Schaumburg, Lipper, Bruckberg, Jaeger. So let's do quick climb and then. Ah, oh, I can't hit them with quick climb. Hit that unit of militia. So, what are you? You are Jaegers. So you have. You do have guns, so I need to be careful of that with my household cavalry so I don't lose a bunch of men unduly. Let's try to deploy stakes really quickly. Okay, so the shot my shot. Let's just start hitting them with my special shells. Keep my hearts as firing regular shot. Sorry about that, guys. It's this stupid software keeps trying to pop up in the background, overrides what I'm doing, and just cuts right in the way. So we do this. Ooh, hello. I want to get within range to have some shots at this light foot unit. Well, this light. With this, um. Yeah, it's third light foot. So they're going to engage me, presumably. Are they going to trot nice and neatly into my spikes? Apparently not. They are trying to engage, but I don't know. Well, they are slightly winning, apparently. Could probably do with more damage than that being done. Cool. Quick line. Start pounding them. See, let's make one of you f hit their artillery with shrapnel shot. Make the right hand one hit the unit with shrapnel shot. Make the unit on the left actually hit their units. Oh, they're firing shrapnel into my guys too. I'll tell a few gunners. Send my send my household cavalry into them. Nope. Run them through my run them through my my light infantry first. Let's see how good they are running away. Not very. We're gonna cut through them. So much devastation. New artillery shells are brilliant.
Good, join the field. God alive. Try hit this unit of mercenaries. Straight on through. Yeah, they're being shot. Now, household cavalry should do pretty good against this unit of militia. Charge was a bit naff. To be honest, get my head light infantry to switch on light infantry behavior and engage the militia. Everyone hit that one unit of provincial line. Oh, may as well chase them down. If you want to make an issue out of this, I'll just run my marines into you. And I'll knock a few of my house or cavalry down, but it won't be enough. Chase them down. Even the militia, just run them down. To be honest, this is just... Just end it. That was just devastating. That was a great, great victory. Awesome. God, they lost 3,230 men. She said prepare for borders, but... Ever so quickly, just go. I don't know, actually, there would, this would be more of a fight. In which case, then, let's bring you over here. So let's take some of my weaker units. Oh no, I can't, they can't move anymore. Either way, at least they're close. So if they do attack me, then I can fight them. And to be honest, what I am going to do is move up my garrison force, because I can send this guy to go lock down Brussels. Maintain siege. I can send... Oh, you were going to get garrison there, weren't you? Forward. I can go send this guy to go down here 
and attack the troops at Calais. Um, but looking at the timer, well, I'm definitely over <laughs> over the recording for this part. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time we will slaughter the Armand de Leonhard Romberg. Cheers. See you guys in the next part.